So, what do we do, Dan? Look, everyone. Look what Farmer Fred's just brought. A great big bowl of orange custard fizz. I know it's not your favourite jollop, but your little cousin Jelly's coming to stay with us today, and she loves it. Such a sweet little dog. You'll be pleased to see Jelly again, won't you, jollop? But we better get this place tidy. Don't want it to see all our mess. <laughs> now, where should we start? Somewhere nice for it to sleep, I think. Oh, perfect, Dan. Jelly will love that. <laughs> oh, look! It's Dotty and Boss. Jelly's here, Jollop. Here she is, Engie Benji. What a lovely little doggy. Hello, Jelly. We're all so excited that you're coming to stay with us, aren't we, Jollop? Well, I'll be off then. I've got a busy day. Welcome to the garage, Jelly. You remember Dan, don't you? And Jollop, of course. Look, we've got you a lovely bed. And we've also got your favourite, orange custard. Oh, that's funny. Anyone seen the orange custard fizz? You wouldn't know anything about the orange custard fizz, would you, Jollop? What's that, Jelly? You're good at finding things. I'm sure you are. Jollop! You hid the orange custard fizz! <sighs> well, that's naughty, Jollop. Come on, Jelly. Time for lunch. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Jelly. A porridge and chocolate sandwich, my favourite. Now, I'll pour you some orange custard fizz and you go and sit on your... <gasps> Jollop! Jollop! <coughs> now, if you don't stop hiding things, there'll be no more biscuits for you today. <coughs> <coughs> Poor old Jollop. Look, team, something's wrong with plane. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what's the matter, Pete? Oh, it's plain. She's... Oh, what a lovely little dog. <laughs> Jelly, this is Pilot Pete. <laughs> and that's plain. <laughs> what's the matter with plain <laughs> Pete? <laughs> <laughs> She's got the hiccups. Hiccups, eh? Oh, that is a problem. What do we do, Dan? <laughs> Ah, yes, my special What to Do When Plane Gets Hiccups book. 
<laughs> Thank you, Jelly. Jelly's very helpful, isn't she? Oh, yes, Pete. She's very, very helpful. Now, hiccups. Let me see. When I get hiccups, the only thing that makes me better is having lots to drink. Eh? But I'd better check. It might be different for planes. Oh, yes, I was right. If your plane has hiccups, give it a good long drink of anything except orange custard fizz. <laughs> orange custard fizz makes a plane spin and whiz. <laughs> Jollop, come back! Come on, team. This is an emergency. Follow that flight. to get them down quickly. Oh, if only Jollop could hear us. Uh, oh, yeah? You can borrow my walkie-talkie radio, Engie Benji. I'll use it to say goodnight to plane when I'm in bed. Good idea, Pete. Jollop! Bark if you can hear me, Jollop. <coughs> well done, Jollop. Now, Pete's going to tell you how to fly plane, so you'll be all right. Ooh. I've never taught a dog to fly before. Never mind. There's always a first time. Right. Um, Jollop, can you see the joystick? It looks like a big bow. That's what I use to fly plane. <laughs> no! Not like that! OK, Jollop, make the stick go straight. He's done it. He's got it straight. And look, they're flying back towards the garage. Come on! <laughs> oh, we need to give Jollop a straight line to follow when he lands. Oh, good idea, Jelly. Jollop can aim at the line of biscuits. <laughs> can you see us yet, Jollop? Yes, yes. Now, push the stick away from you to come lower, Jollop, and aim for the biscuits. That's it, Jollop. Keep flying straight. <laughs> I can't look. <laughs> Oh, well done, Jollop. You saved plane. <laughs> plane, listen. Your hiccups have gone. <laughs> it must be the shock of landing, Pete. Look, it says here in my book, if a drink doesn't work, a shock will normally do the trick. Oh, plane. Every dog has its day. <laughs> vroom, vroom. From giraffes with a sore neck to snakes that have lost their slither, the animal hospital is open to all the animals next. <laughs>